Electricast. Welcome to the Congressional Record Daily Digest, where we bring you all the previous session's U.S. legislative proceedings in three minutes or less. In today's episode, we bring you the Congressional Record for March 7, 2024. In a significant legislative day, both the Senate and the House were active with key discussions and decisions. The Senate notably passed the Radiation Exposure Compensation Reauthorization Act, S-3853, with a vote of 69 to 30. This legislation extends compensation to those affected by radiation during nuclear weapons testing and the Manhattan Project, notably impacting former uranium miners and communities exposed to radiation. Additionally, the Senate approved the designation of certain segments of the Port to Plains Corridor as Interstate Route 27, influencing transportation and economic development in Texas and New Mexico. In the House, a major move was the passage of the Lake and Riley Act, H.R. 7511, mandating the Secretary of Homeland Security to detain aliens charged with theft. This law aims to enhance immigration enforcement and public safety. Both chambers convened in a joint session to receive the State of the Union address from the President, an event that sets the administration's agenda. Moreover, the Senate confirmed several nominations, affecting the judicial system and the operations of regulatory agencies. Committee meetings across both chambers covered topics from defense and banking to foreign relations and health, shaping policy in these crucial areas. This day of legislative action directly impacted Americans and shaped the broader national policy landscape. Those were the key activities of March 7, 2024, in the U.S. Congress. Subscribe to receive daily and rate or review so others can find us as well. Thanks for tuning into the Congressional Record Daily Digest. This has been an Electricast Media production. Executive producers are Mark Netter and Peter Rafelson. Producer is Ivy Hopper. Electric ass.